Good morning everyone! So a couple months back, I found an indie game that I've been really wanting to try out, and it itself describes a Norwegian happy sad game set in a northern land, adventure through a beautiful and very varied wilderness. Dive, fly, use zip lines, and find different weapons to aid your journey to reach the cold mountains and below. Encounter over 50 unique bosses and enemy types. I want to encounter 50 unique bosses and enemy types, so I launched the game and after 13 hours, I wanted to share with you my northern journey. My journey begins sailing away on a boat, headed to uh, somewhere I guess. Well, that's a problem. I ended up washing up on the shores of Deadwell, where I proceeded to learn about fall damage. Oh, no fall damage? I later meet the strange man who told me the only way out of the island is to help him. No, I'm good. I think I'm just gonna go this way. We'll see about that. <laughs> what do you need help with, sir? After he told me that he wants me to receive three items that were stolen from him, I made my way into town, where I met the village idiot, his pet snake, the sheriff's dog, the sheriff, and his prisoner. What? The priest and two witches. Once I met everyone, I was instructed to talk to the inventor to set me up with a weapon to prepare me for my journey. What, my weapon's a fucking sling? Yeet! After acquiring my new weapon, I then headed to the forest path. Once there, the traveling flute player informed me I needed to collect five shields in order to progress. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Number one. Where am I? Oh god. Oh, not again! Come on! Ooh. Fuck. Fuck. God damn it. God damn it. Hi. <gasps> oh my god. <laughs> Number two. Hello, Mario. During my travels, I met this woman who was nice enough to ferry me across this pond. Number three, my lord. God fucking damn it. My ass, bitch. Fuck you, stinky. Bro, I'm so fucking bad. Oh my god. Idiot. <gasps> Idiot. Damn it. <laughs> no, I'm bad. <gasps> Puggers, no. Stop! Stop! No! Cool. I'm. I'm. You fucking. <laughs> he didn't catch me that time. Let's fucking go! Number four. 
<gasps> he ate the fucking dog, no! <sighs> Mummy? I'm fucking stupid. I'm so fucking stupid. I've been looking for hours and I had to watch two hours of gameplay just to figure out what the fuck I was supposed to do. God damn it. Hello whore, you're gone. You curse me, I curse you fucking bitch. Don't you smile at me, you fucking whore. Barrel. Number five. <laughs> After defeating all the previous wielders of the shields, the path to my next destination opens. There, I found the rope pulley I needed, had an encounter with Noken. and got the key needed to really start my northern journey. It was here that I found out about the items that I was trying to retrieve, that they were called Dimensional Violators, and that the witches possessed one of them. So my first real destination was finally set. After a long journey, it was finally time to face the witches. I did it again! I'm just bad at video games. God need to find me a man like him. Shit. Number one, let's go. Uh oh. God, I'm fucking dog shit. Oh my god, please, please! No, 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 no! I'm so confused. Oh my god, my fucking brain. God fucking damn it. Ah. Oh my god. Yeah, number two, baby, let's go. What? I have a diving kit. What do you, what do you mean? Uh, <laughs> 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 
after finally defeating the village idiot's pet worm, we finally get the last dimensional violator. Now the flute player wants me to defend Dimensional Violator until it has taken enough damage for it to explode, finally defeating the fool. And after that final climactic battle, my northern journey has finally come to an end. Good night, everybody.